welcome back. So far, you've created a coaching vision. You've turned that coaching vision into a concrete coaching choice board or menu to offer teachers. And now it's time to give yourself some support and making sure that coaching vision stays strong all year long. So as coaches, we have to work really hard on our own professional learning. Every coach deserves a coach too. So who we surround ourselves with, whether it's in-person colleagues, online through social media, or the blogs or organizations we follow or are part of, they all matter. And I'm here to offer you one particular way to connect yourself to the kind of information, resources, and professionals that can support your work. Before we even move on to the lots of things that you could do to support teachers, you first need to create a support system for yourself. And so I'm here today to share one very easy but very powerful way to create that system using blog loving. I know it probably seems odd, but it really is the number one thing I have done to support my own learning as a coach. And so Blog Lovin is this platform that curates your favorite blogs all in one place. So if you're anything like me, you follow lots of coaches, you follow lots of blogs, and you try to remember to visit those blogs or bookmark them or like them on social media so that you can find them later. But also like me, you likely don't get to do that very often or you forget about the blog, you forget to check, you've lost where you saved it and on and on and on. Enter Blog Lovin. Blog Lovin is a site where you can sign up for free and you can follow all of your favorite blogs on Blog Lovin. And what they will do is take that and turn it into this personalized email where all of your favorite blogs that have updated their blog within the last 24 hours will be included in that email for you to browse on your own time. So I get my blog love and email by 7 a.m. each morning and I can quickly scroll through it to see which of my favorite blogs put something new up. Which do I want to go check out today? And that reminder in my email is just the reminder I need to take a few minutes, read, browse, maybe even view, and just fuel myself up with content before I give it away to everybody else all day. And so this is an example of what mine looks like. So you'll see it's a blog love and daily digest that will come to your email. I have mine configured to come quite early since I'm an early bird, but you could change that time in your settings if you'd like. And you can see the top stories from my feed and underneath would be all of the blogs I follow and all of the recent posts within 24 hours. So here are a few of my favorite blogs that I follow for inspiration. Now, hopefully you already are following mine which is The Coaching Sketch Notebook at thecoachingsketchnotebook.com. If you're looking for blogs that are not just focused on coaching, but are focused on teaching and learning, here are some of my favorites. Now I'm gonna link to these in the links and resources section of this video, so don't try to scribble them down now. They will definitely be there for you to follow. And hopefully if you have some favorites, you'll leave your favorites in the comments so that they can turn into my favorites as well. So here's your job for today. This is kind of a quick one. You've done a lot of work coming up with your vision and creating your coaching menu. Today, you're gonna to celebrate and you're gonna surround yourself with some coaching love. You're gonna to head to blogloven.com. You are going to find your favorite blogs and add them to your feed. You're gonna customize your email time and just wait till tomorrow and enjoy that first delivery. Now here is a quick look at what it looks like. Now don't make fun of how many tabs they have open on my computer. <laughs> so once you get into blog Lovin, it'll look kind of like this. And there will be lots of blogs that you could scroll through. Now you're going to search blog Lovin, And let's say, let me see of a favorite blog. I'm gonna put Lit Coach Connection, which is another one of my favorites. Now you can see it pops up. So if you click on it, 
Oh, goodness. Of course, this is happening as we're recording live. Normally, when you click on it, it will allow you to follow. So let's see. Let's try the Heinemann blog. I know that one will be good. Heinemann, did I spell it right? I think I did. So now we've got some different options, right? People or, or organizations. So I'm already following it, but you would have a button here that allows you to follow. So I recommend that you put in all of your favorite blogs that you love, put in the blogs of the instructional organizations you follow, like ILA or NCTE or ISTE, put in um, publishers blogs that you enjoy, and just create this collection of support for yourself so that every morning you've got a little dose of inspiration coming to you so that you can turn around and give that inspiration back to your teachers. So blogloving.com, create your free account, type in the names of those blogs and click follow. And if you'd like, you can go into your settings and you can customize when you want that daily email to arrive. So that's it for today. Take five, 10 minutes, start to surround yourself with all of this coaching inspiration. I promise it will make a difference as you head through the rest of the, the virtual coaching roadmap and just head into your future coaching days as well. Who and what we surround ourselves with matters. And as silly as it might sound, starting with this blood loving account can make all the difference in the world.